Hello friends, this is Teacher JB. Let us study English. We are studying the book English Grammar in News. And today we are going to study Unit 20. I am going to do. I am going to do. I am going to do something means I have already decided to do it. Or I intend to do it. Are you going to eat anything? No, I'm not hungry. I hear Sarah won the lottery. What's she going to do with the money? She's going to buy a new car. I'm just going to make a quick phone call. Can you wait for me? This cheese smells horrible. I'm not going to eat. I am doing and I'm going to do. I am doing means it is already fixed or arranged. For example, you have arranged to go somewhere or meet somebody. You say, I'm leaving next week. I booked my flight. What time are you meeting Emily this evening? And then you say, I am going to do something. It means I have decided to do it. Maybe I've arranged to do it, maybe not. Your shoes are dirty. Yes, I know. I'm going to clean them. It means I have decided to clean them, but I haven't arranged this uh, with anybody. I don't want to stay here. Tomorrow I'm going to look for somewhere else to stay. Now compare. I don't know what I'm doing tomorrow. It means I don't know my schedule or plans. I don't know what I'm going to do about the problem. It means I have not decided what to do. Often the difference is small and either form is possible. You can also say that something is going to happen in the future. Something is going to happen in the future. The man isn't looking where he's going and he's going to walk into the wall. When we say that something is going to happen, the situation now makes this clear. The man is walking towards the wall now, so we can say that he's going to walk into it. Some more examples here. Look at those black clouds. It is going to rain. We can see the clouds now. I feel terrible. I think I'm going to be sick. It means I feel terrible now. The economic situation is bad now and things are going to get worse. I was going to do something means I intended to do it, but didn't do it. We are going to travel by train, but then we decide to drive instead. I was just going to cross the road when somebody shouted, stop. You can say that something was going to happen, but didn't happen. I thought it was going to rain, but it didn't. Now let us do some exercises. Write questions with going to. Your friend has won some money and you ask, what are you going to do with it? Your friend is going to a wedding next week. You ask, what are you going to wear? Okay, so here, what are you? going to wear? What are you going to wear? And number three, your friend has just bought a new table. You ask, where are you going to put it? So where are you? And then going to put it. Where are you going to put the table? 
Your friend has just died, decided to have a party, you ask. Who are you going to invite? Who are you going to? Who are you going to invite? Okay, number five. Your friend has bought some fish for dinner, you ask. How are you going to cook it? So this one, some fish, it could be cook them. How are you going to cook it or cook them, some fish? Cook them. How are you going to cook it or how, how are you going to cook them? Complete the sentence using I'm going to, I'm not going to. Complain, learn, run, say, try, watch, not accept, not eat, not tell. This cheese smells horrible. I'm not going to eat. I'm not going to eat it. I haven't been trying hard enough. From now on, I'm going to try harder. I am, I'm going to try harder. I have to make a speech tomorrow, but I don't know what I'm going to say. I don't know what I'm going to say. The car is very dirty. I know. I'm going to wash it. I am going to wash it. I'm going to wash it. I've been offered a job, but, but I'm not going to accept it. The pay is too low, but I'm not. I'm sorry, I'm not going to accept it. The pay is too low. Blank your language, but I haven't decided yet. Which one? I'm going to learn a language. I am going to learn a language, but I haven't decided yet. Which one? And number seven, one day blank in a marathon. It's my ambition. So it's going to be one day I am going to run in a marathon. It's my ambition. Number eight, the food in this restaurant is awful. So I'm going to complain it. I am going to complain. I'm going to complain. Ben doesn't need to know what happened, so I'm not going to tell him. I'm not going to tell him. What is going to happen in this situation? Use the words in brackets. There are a lot of black clouds in the sky, so it is going to rain. It is 8.30. Tom is leaving home. He has to be at work at 8.45, but the journey takes 30 minutes. So already late. He is going to be late. He is, he is going to be late. He is going to be late. There is a hole in the button of the boat, bottom of the boat, a lot of water is coming in through the hole. So I think the boat is going to, the boat is going to sink. The boat is going to sink. Number four, Amy and Ben are driving. The tank is near, nearly empty. It's a long way to the nearest uh, petrol station. So this one, gas station in America. 
gas station and they it says they're going to run out of gas they are going to run out of run out of petrol or you can say gas gasoline Sarah's car was badly damaged in an accident now it has to be repaired cost a lot it is going to it is going to cost a lot cost a lot of money cost a lot to repair okay sorry to repair the car okay the last page complete the sentences with was we're going to and choose the words from be buy give up phone play say travel we were going to travel by train but then we decided to go by car instead i planned some new clothes yesterday but i didn't have time to go to the shop to go to the shops i was going to i was going to buy some new clothes yesterday but i didn't have time to go to the shops and tom and i planned tennis last week but he'd hurt his knees and had to cancel so tom and i were going to play tennis tom and i were going to play tennis last week but he'd hurt his knee and had to cancel number four i blank jane but i sent her an email instead i was going to call her i was going to okay, here you say phone or you can you can say call i was going to call her call, call jane but i sent her an email instead number five i thought the exam blank hard but it was easier than i expected i thought the exam was going to be hard but it was okay number six peter blanked his job but in the end he decided to stay where he was peter was going to peter was going to give up his job but in the end he decided to stay where he was the last one for today i'm sorry i interrupted you what were you going to say what were you going to say and somebody was trying to say something but somehow i interrupted the person and you can say I'm, I'm sorry i interrupted you what were you saying or what were you going to say okay friends this is the conclusion of today's study i'll come back to you with another unit as soon as possible until then keep studying english and have a great day bye